All right, Chapter 5, Blue Signal Protection Working, Part 218. The minimum requirements of Blue Signal Protection Workman as provided in Title 49 CFR, Part 218, Subpart B. An example of the blue signal shown in Figure 1, Subpart B, that requires the road to make a certain measures to protect their employees who engage in inspection, testing, repairing, servicing of rolling equipment is designed to reduce the number of serious accidents resulting from human factors railroad may describe additional and more stringent requirements found in this regulation. Figure 1 shows the blue signal attached to a snow-covered track in the train yard. One of the following pages you will find a section regulation that interprep the guidance for the related information to it. A, A, the inspector performance of the blue signal inspection after each section regulation interpretation policies established by the FRA. Report the blue inspection order to be made by the inspection of report F1, F618096 violations are permitted by the summit by the form F618096. 67. On some occasions, there may be necessary to devote major portion of the inspection data to the conducting blue signal observation. However, there may and most inspection inspectors should incorporate the blue signal inspection with the routine inspection activities. For example, during a locomotive inspection, locomotive repair facility, the observation facility, the blue signal protection would appropriate. Before conducting a blue signal inspection, you will acknowledge the enemy personal permissible alternative method provided with the route required protection. For instance, above the equipment, the railroad option would weather to be procedure with the statute 218 27 29 to protect the locomotive service track area before entering the particular location you must also be aware of any waivers of regulation applicable to location remember that part um, railroad's obligation to provide blue signal and in protection inspectors should not be uh, ordered to railroad personnel to stop working nor should the inspector should establish a blue signal protection is the inspector responsibility to monitor determine whether the blue signal protection is being applied correctly if not being applied correctly the inspector must take appropriate enforcement action to correct the situation non compliance with the blue signal regulations are serious and can lead to injury or death. 218 subpart A general. This um, 218.1 purpose. The part, um, the part prescribes the minimum requirements for the railroad operating rules each and practices. Each railroad may describe additional and more stringent requirements and operating rules, timetables, timetables, special instructions, or the other and special instructions. 218.3 application except provided in paragraph B of this section. This part of the railroad is to operate the rolling equipment on the standard gauge track with the part of the ra general railroad system of transportation. B this part does not apply. The railroad operates only on track inside of the installation, which is not part of the general railroad system of the transportation. And two, rapid transportation of train, transit, rapid transit op operations in urban areas that are not connected to the general railroad system of the transportation guidance. Blue signals reg regulations apply to the railroad operating railroad rolling equipment on single, single standard gauge. This part of the general railroad system of the transportation does not apply to the railroad operating only on the tracks inside the installation. This is not part of the general railroad system of the railroad operates only the tracks that are must exclusively used exclusively for the upon rapid transit. However, the railroad employee was working under, on or under the rolling of the equipment of the tracks located inside the railroad in industry plant served by the railroad. Blue signal protection must be established. It does not apply to the contractor even though the working on the rolling equipment on the standard gauge track that is part of the general railroad transportation. 218.5 definitions. Absolute block means the block in which no train is permitted to enter without, uh, w w which w while it's occupied by another train. Blue signal means a clearly a distinguishable blue flag or blue light day by the day of the blue light at night, and when attached with the operating controls, the locomotive it may be needed, not lit if the inside of the cab or the locomotive is sufficiently lit lighted so that uh, make the cab make the blue signal clearly distinguishable. Camp car it means of any of the on track of a vehicle, including off fit camp, bunk cars, and modular homes mo mounted on flat cars used to house rail employees. It does not include wrecked trains. Car shop. Repair track means one or more tracks within the area when testing the servicing, repairing, inspection, rebuilding, rolling, railroad rolling equipment is under the exclusive control of the mechanical department personnel controlling locomotive means the locomotive in range of having the only controls over our electronical, mechanical, pneumatical functions for more than one or more locomotives, and locomotives including controls transmitted by the railroad signal if and equi so equipped it does not include them two or more locomotives coupled in multiple when which can be moved from more than one set of locomotive controls. Designated crew member when an individual designated under the railroad operating rules at the point of the contact between the train and the yard crew with the ultimate employee working with the crew. The effective locking devices when used relation uh, manual operated switch to derail means one of which vandal restraint, res randall resistant, tamper resistant, and capable of being locked and unlocked, but only by class and craft crew, groups of employees from which the protection was provided. Group workers means of two or more workers of the same different cra crafts assigned to work with together with a unit commonly for authority with the communication with each of the while working is being done. 
Locomotive means a self um, propelled unit designed to move, move moving railroad rolling equipment and the revenue service, including the self propelled unit designed to carry the freight passenger traffic of the both may consist of one or more operated with single control. Locomotive service tracking area means of one or more tracks which are in which testing, servicing, repair, instructions for building the locomotives is under the exclusive, exclusive control of the mechanical departure personnel. Main track means the track other than the auxiliary track extending for the yards between the stations upon which the operated timetable and train ordered both of the uses which governed by the signal system. Rolling equipment, um, including locomotives, railroad cars, and one or more locomotives coupled to one or more cars. So switching for providing access means a switch of the transverse rolling equipment could permit rolling equipment to couple with the, uh, to the equipment being protected. Train, yard, and crew means if one or more railroad employees assigned with the controlling locomotive under change control, one or crew member called to perform the service covered with the Section 2 of the Hour Service Act involved with the train, yard, movement, of the road uh, Railroad rolling equipment that they work with the training operating with the operating crew reporting working together with the unit it remains in close contact with the if and more and more employer subject to the railroad operating rules program operational test inspection of the statute two seventeen nine and two seventeen eleven of this chapter. Utility employee means the railroad employee is assigned to the functional, the temporary memory, uh, member of the train yard and who is primarily the function is assist the train yard crew in assembly, disassemble classification railway cars and operations subject to the conditions set forth in statute two eighteen twenty two. Worker means any railroad employee assigned to the inspect the test railroad and surface of railroad rolling equipment components, including the brake system, member of the train yard crews, and exclude except for the assigned such workers roll at railroad rolling equipment that is not in part of the train yard and have been called and operated to be assigned with the utility employees. Utility employees assigned with the function temporary members of the specific train yard crew. Ex subject conditions set forth in Statute 2, 1822 with the sub chapter excluded only when assigned to the function. Note, um, service does not include the sub supplying lo um, cabooses, locomotive passenger cards when items such as ice, drink, wiring, water tools, sanitary supplies, sanitary flagging, equipment testing does not include visual operations may be made on the employee position alongside with the caboose, locomotive passenger marking, inspection may be in accordance with the provision Statute 221716B of this chapter. Your blue signal means a clearly distinguishable blue blue flag, blue sign, blue light. The effect of the blue signal is dependent on the device being clearly distinguished and due to the operator control of the movement of the rolling equipment. Therefore, the compliance must be evaluated with the mind of the madly deteriorated blood. blue signal when it is covered with the oil and dirt and cannot be considered to be compliance. Blue light with a weak battery, broken lens, or blue signal will be obviously inadequate. The size and intensity cannot be clearly distinguished or not in compliance with the requirement of the regulations. A blue signal used might night. Used it and may not be illuminated unless the unleaded device is attached to the control locomotive with the cab locomotive adequately lighted so that makes a blue sing signal clearly distinguishable. This allows the blue light to be used by day, both but the inspector should be determined that it is clearly distinguishable. Either size and intensity, the inspector should also consider the intensity of the light, lights of the night and flood washing, but the effect of the blue light exemption should be, be taken. Small lights are designed to be used in the cab locomotive, should not be used in the gauge of the track unless intensity lights make it clearly distinguishable due to operate the control of the rolling equipment. All right, car shop repair track area it means one or more tracks within the area with the testing and service room repair or building or railroad or rolling equipment and is under the exclusive control of mechanical department. Sure, department personnel includes the heavy repair tracks located within the building as well as the tracks the total erecting where build, building rolling rolling equipment occurs. Your controlling locomotive means the locomotive the controlling in the cab of the propulsion sand system standards and the power brake system of each of the locomotive pneumatically, electrically, and mechanically connected together existing in this electrically can either jump or cable or by radio signal mechanically means of the locomotive units physically coupled together pneumatically means of the appropriate air hose the correct uh, with the control operating with the brakes air connected to cut in. The effective locking device means the device that can be locked or unlocked only by the class of the craft, the group of the workmen performing the work on the rolling c c equipment. It must be substantial construction, des technically designed so that the vandal resistant, tamper resistant, rail clamp with the switch po point rolling d blocking device cannot be locked does and does not apply when the consult when with a uh, requirement of the regulation train yard crews should not be able to unswitch uh, unswitch switches and rebrail protection workmen unless other they are group of the workmen performing the work of the task that requires the blue signal protection if the train of the yard crew needs to apply the blue signal um, protection, a standard operations department switch lock will not satisfy the requirements of this regulation and other with the standard switch lock can be used as long as the other train in the yards cannot unlock it remotely Controlled switch can must be um, have a plug in the key coverly properly applied to the control panel, which impl 
and mobilized with the switch control level that should be, be, be secured to establish protection. It must be applied in such a manner that the control lever can be thrown for the route with the protection of the track without first without first removing the device. A written tag alone attaching to the bottom of the lever does not apply to comply. A remotely controlled switch that can be overridden in the field using the manual lever when establishing the prior authority, taking the switch out of the power must be treated with a manual switch to the effect of locked in the field. The inspectors should physically examine and test the locking device to ensure the lock of functions is intended. Group of workers, meaning means of two or more workers who are the same of the different craft. They are assigned to work together on unit and ground under the common authority, such as a lead man, roundhouse foreman, and a car shop foreman, for all members of the group and some of the form of the communication with each other with the work is being performed. Locomotive means a self-propelled on-the-track piece of equipment designed with moving the revenue for aid of the passenger cars over the railroad. The traditional locomotive powered by the electrical the city does use electric the turbine and steam that could be used in the form of the self-provide uh, self -provide high rail vehicle using the revenue service based upon the definition of the written regulation of the ME multiple unit car would be a locomotive with a control cab with the suburban push-pull passenger train operation would, unless the locomotive were attached to its controls in the control cab wearing cut in with the blue signal protection where you can remote control locomotives is handled with the same manner in the traditional locomotives. What is required to establish blue signal protection in the remote control locomotive? The locomotive in the manual operation establishes blue signal protection as is the regular locomotive. Locomotive servicing track areas means of one or more tracks within the area that is under exclusive control of the mechanical department and personnel and it concludes the tracks are describing the but the back shop and the tracks within the located inside of the buildings with the major overhang of the rebuilding of the locomotive with the curves as to and from the with protected area would have the become from the mechanical departure personnel charge in the, that area. Main track has been re, um, railroad operating rules for many years should have been common to mean and throughout the industry to be the extent that it should be not mistaken for the track commonly known by such other defined as the yard tracks or siding, the judging and compliance with the regulation, the fact that the authority of the movement of the track of the rule 93 of the yard limits, the no bearing of the interpretation, therefore, the, any of the track that does not meet the definition of the main track or the other main track rolling equipment on the locomotives of the railroad cars for any combination of the of such is not to be included with the purpose of the regulation maintenance of the way track of the equipment is protected with the means. Also, derailing situations does not require the blue signal protection switch provided with the access access protective equipment standing on the entrance of the switch so that it is prevented with the equipment the inter entering the track with the switch and, and ceases to be accessed to the switch however once the switch composed with the exposed the permit out of the other the equipment to enter the protected track and coupled with the protected cars that becomes the pro switch pro provided providing access <laughs> trainer yard crew members Trainer yard crew members are permitted to work on or under between any roller. <laughs> any railroad rolling equipment they are co called to operate without establishing blue signal protection. Note that the train yard exclusion only applies to the equipment that they are called to operate. They cannot use, assist any another crew unless the blue protection is established. If the track warrants blue signal protection, uh, the entire, including the crew, including the locomotive, is involved in assisting in another crew, provided that both crews of the communication with each other and aware of the movements of the to be made. Can, can a train crew member perform a mechanical repair change and can break shoe without establishing a blue signal protection. Yes, if the repairs are performed with equipment with the crew member is called to operate if the crew member is not working with a utility employee. Um, can a members of one crew assist another crew such as m making a couple, coupling of the road crossing or placing and changing the end of the train batteries, changing the brake hose without establishing a blue signal? No, it would have to involve the entire crew including the use of the locomotive to handle the equipment assisting of the other crew the, if the, only the few crew a few crew members assist in the other crew. The blue signal protection must be established. Utility employee, uh, UE, is not restricted to particular craft or job title. The utility employee may be in a railroad employee provided with all the prerequisites contained with the statute 2-18-22-A are met. Workers mean the railroad employees assigned to the inspection, testing, the repair, service, and railroad rolling of the equipment components, including the brake system, train yard crews, excluded with the except for the assigned to perform the such work of the railroad rolling company is not part of the train yard movement that had been called to operate the train yard crew member exclusion based on the rationale of the crew members working together with the operating crew where their assigned locomotive engineering of the control locomotives would have complete control of the movement any of the rolling equipment on which they were working. Railroad security forces clerical personnel who build the railroads for the purpose of checking the landing of the 
pilferage of the vandalism storehouse and employees loading and unloading. Even when using a forklift, they're not considered with the workforce. It's defined with the power with the guns. They're not assigned to inspect tests or repair service the railroad rolling equipment. Therefore, the blue signal protection is not required under the regulation. Fueling and sanding locomotives do not require blue signal protection because provided to the task do not require the individual to go under the or between the locomotive. The law only applies to the railroad worker. The team railroad worker means the employee who employed is paid directly by the railroad. Non-railroad employees, contractors, suppliers are not required to use blue signal protection under the federal regulation, although many of the railroad requires the individual to comply with the blue regu- signal regulations as part of the condition of their contracts. The FRA cannot enforce the contract using the blue signal protection. However, an inspector should advise the railroad com- non-compliance and known that the railroad experts and the contractor comply. Servicing is noted with the footnote but the definition does not include the supplying caboose, locomotive passengers, and with such items. Items such as ice, drinking water, tools, sanitary supplies, stationary, or flagging equipment. All right, testing does not include the visual observation made by the employee peasant position in, inside a long uh, a caboose, locomotive, passenger car, worker involved with these specific activities are not deemed with the hazard position shown. It would be prevented with an inadvertent move, uh, inadvertently move. Part 218, subpart B, blue signal protection workers. 21821. The scope of the um, the subparts prescribe the me, me, uh, minimum requirements of the protection railroad employees engaged with the inspection, testing, and repair of the service and rolling equipment with the activities requiring with the work on or between such equipment subjects to the man- danger of the per- personal injury with the movement of such equipment. Guidance. Initially, rational developing the language of the subsection with the general work of the categories inspecting, testing, repair, and servicing usually required the employee to go on or between the rolling equipment that is doing so that the employee would be in proximity of the equipment when he or she would be vulnerable to the possibility of serious personal injury, unexpected movement of equipment as it were to occur. However, they identify those general work activities as position of the relations with the roll, road rolling in which the broad terms inevitable would be encompassed the number of the specific jobs that defined but not include suppose the worker to be any personal injury. The FRA recognized the pre document revised in the language in 1979 inserted the word in the regula- and in the regulatory language and subjects that danger them personal injury. Therefore, it is not solely that the work be done inspection, testing, repairing, servicing, and whether the employee's is position of relationship within the equipment on, under, or between, but also whether the cause of it to be placed in potential hazard position. Generally, non hazard would be combined with, with where the hazard of blue signal protection is required. However, there may be times where the non- certain non hazardous works may be in- isolated in such a manner with the blue signal protection were not required. For example, the equipment inspection that can be employed for the position with the ground alongside the equipment does not represent the hazardous situation seated with the control locomotive manipulating with the air brake, handles throttling and settling with a multiple unit valve on the control standing does not um, represent the hazardous situation. Testing in an air brake situation purely, pu- um, purely visual in nature requires the employee to observe the position of the air brake position when standing on the br- ground beside the car. In another example, the non-hazardous situation would not require the blue signature or the example of the, in the employee with the go on the equipment to observe the piston travel to any of the truck mounted brake system. The signal si- blue signal protection is required. Part 215 pre department inspection would require the blue signal protection because the individual making of the inspection would have to go under the in between the equipment to properly conduct the inspection. The train crew making the appendix D the inspection would not have to establish the blue signal protection if the equipment they called they are called to operate. We're conducting a purely visible inspection of the locomotive as long as the employee does not go on the locomotive, stepping in the engine compartment, going on the roof of the locomotive, and the employee would not be on the heads of this situation. For example, gauging the wheels would require a blue signal protection individual work. Sorry, individual would be um, would be under the equipment and an employee with the in, in engine to compartment to um, doors look inside and inspect the oil, the water leaks, exhaust, and clear checking the clear cooling of the water cycle, as checking the oil. And as long as the employee does not physically step inside the engine compartment, does not anything that beyond the visual check all, all without establishing a blue signal protection. The locomotive engineer is conducting an inspection, or he or she is not called to operate, and the blue now blue signal 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 protection is required. All right, certain services activities carried out by, by without the exposure of the danger example of those activities would be bleeding of the air brake system on the cars, oil, bed, journal boxes, passenger car, coach, interior, exterior, cleaning and not require using the ladders, evacuating the recharging passenger soil, car soil, holding tanks, supplying passenger cars with water and supplying locomotives with water or fuel, attaching the hose to the exterior outlet, checking radios or H- head train departments, uh, of the locomotives that will quickly quick disconnect fittings do not require the use of tools. For instance, when sanding a locomotive can be accomplished, the attaching of sanding of the hose to a side of the filler will properly physically group the locomotive. Um, 
Similarly, certain supply activities supply the local movement of the ice and the water, the fuse, the stationary paper towel, and can be carried out with exposure to dan- without exposure to danger. These similar activities will effectively combine with the specific non hazard work function due to the non required blue signal protection. The certain activity definitely called for the display of the blue signal example, such as the activities were performed on non trained non yard cr- non-yard crew members, breaking, making, and the air codes, connection, connecting, disconnecting electronic co cables between the cable, um, installing, removing, servicing, and repairing rear end devices, markers, or telemetry units. Any Air brake te- tests requiring employees to go under the between the rolling stack, replacing broken windows, changing the brake shoes. Activity that requires the use of the ladder, performing electrical repairs, and they involve the work partially with a holy that combines with the electrical cabinet. Inspecting the underage ca- carriage with, from the pit, repairing the closing of the doors of the cars if to cool required. All these certain activities do not cause the work to pres- position themselves in such a way that they're vulnerable to personal injury if an unexpected movement of the equipment occurred. <laughs> In the event that the worker has positioned himself or herself between the rails at the end of the car, the worker, the, the, the when when changing the knuckle or the air hose, blue signal protection is required when the repairs require the work to be on or under between the rolling equipment. The blue signal un- unquestionably are required of the function and nature of the work performed and determines the protective prote- provisions of the rule, no, not the craft, the title of the employee. The blue signal regulations do not apply with the derailment situation is assuring that the protection of the workers involved with the such an operation responsibility for the individual railroad in accordance with the opera own operating rules. Such operation usually well coordinated um, control operations under the direction of rec masters and transportation supervisors at the scene requiring the blue signals required under these circumstances work with a responsible hamper re-relling operation unlike the routine operations all personally involved with the type of the work will be aware and special conditions exist and are familiar with the necessary precautions to get take and equipment to make move moves take pl- place. Mechanical track maintenance um, operations do not require blue signal protection as these operations address the railroad operating rules and the regulation under the railroad r- r- operating rules flags and other color with the designated for the purpose of these rules the specific manner in which they are displayed to provide with the protection of operation um, taking a track out of the service does not provide the relief of the regulation. Blue signal protection would have to be established on the, uh, and on out of service tracks if it were being performed required um, performed requires it. Statute 280.22 Utility employee. A utility employee shall subject to the hours of service of the act requirements of the training and the testing, control, of alcohol abuse, alcohol and drug abuse, um, hours and service record keeping the provided with this part 217, 219, and 228 of this chapter. A, a utility employee shall perform the service member only on the one train of the yard crew any of the given time service with more of the crew more, maybe substantially, subsequently, but not concurrent. A utility employee may be assigned to serve the member of the train yard crew without the protection otherwise required by the subpart D of the part D 218 of the chapter only under the following condition the train yard crew is assigned with control locomotive under the actual control assigned with the locomotive engineer of the crew to the locomotive engineer of the crab of the control the locomotive of the locomotive is stationary replaced with the cab and another crew of the same crew the employee and established with the communication with the crew contacting designation of the crew arriving with the train defined with the purpose of the section of one or more locomotives without, with or without the car or is before the commencing of any of any of the duties with the crew. Before each utility employee commences the duty of the designated crew member shall provide the notice with each of the crew member present intended at any of the utility employee once all the crew members have acknowledged the notice as any crew member should advise the utility employee that he or she is authorized to work with a part of the crew. Therefore, the communication shall be maintained in such a manner that each of the members of the training yard crew does understand the duties to be performed, whether those duties are causing any of the crew member to go under the, between the rolling equipment and the utility employee performing one of them of the following function set of the re sandbook, coupling, uncoupling air heroes, electrical, mechanical connections, prepared the rip or cars for coupling, setting up the wheel blocks and wheel tunes, conduct air brake testing to include the cutting of the air brake components in or out, the position retaining the valve and the inspection testing, the installing or removing the replacing the rear end marketing device and the end of the train device, you under the all circumstances utility employee working under then between railroad rolling equipment must be provided with a blue signal protection in accordance with the statute 218.23 and statute 218.30 of this part. When, I, when, I, when the utility employee has ceased all the work connection with the train is no longer under the between the, the equipment the utility employee shall notif- notify the design crew, designated crew member. The designated crew member shall um, provide the notice to the, each of the crew members that the utility employment is released with the crew. One of these of the crew members acknowledged the notice the designated crew member shall have notified the utility employee that he is released from the train of the yard crews. 
Communication required in Statute 21822 G four D it shall be conducted between the utility employee for the designated crew member. The communication shall be conducted with either through the direct verbal contact of the railroad compliance with the part two twenty and of the chapter but oral telecommunication equivalent integrity. No more than three utility employees may be attached to one train or yard crew crew at any given time. Any railroad employee who is assigned with the train yard crew to authorize the work on the crew under the conditions set forth in B for the section work required to provide with the blue signal in accordance with the statute two eighteen twenty three through two eighteen thirty three. 218.30 of this part. Nothing in this section should affect the alternative protection specified in 221.16 and chapter of this respect inspection of the rear end marking devices. Guidance with individual working utility employee, the, uh, he or she is working with a temporary number of the specified train yard crew. This allows the utility employee to exclude the blue signal protection requirements on all the performing tasks listed in the statute 218.22c5. And then under all other circumstances, the utility employee works under the and on and under the between the rolling equipment must be provided with the blue signal protection and defined and sta as defined in statute 218.5. The utility employee is not restricted to any particular craft or job type. The utility employee may be in a railroad employee provided with the prerequisites contained with the statute. G2 1822 of the Met, namely the utility employee subject to the railroad operating rules due hours of the service law of the federal, federal drug and alcohol regulation of the utility employee, mechanically department employee, car man, machinist, etc. Abbreviated version of instruction of the operating rules can be given to satisfy the requirements of Part 275, 17. The regulation assigned with the utility employment is only to the crew at the time of the necessary, preventing with the confusion and location duties of the employee to ensure the employees, if in fact the members of the crew to which he or she is assigned with the duration assignment, a train yard crew member cannot be the utility employee work with another train yard crew unless the train yard crew she originally started with the completed in this tour of the duties were reconstituted to the new assignment. When conducting inspection compliance with the guard, with the use of the utility employees, the inspector should monitor the following communication between the utility employee and the ranking crew member. The utility employment employee and crew member the most comply with the required operating procedures attaching and to and detaching the crew when the communication may be face to face with the radio, telephone, own, or some other form of the communication. Presence of the locomotive engine, other crew that may be control compartment and of the control of the control locomotive, but the utility employee performs the duties of the rolling equipment assigned to the train yard or train or yard crew. No nature of the work performed with the utility employee should ensures the employee does not perform the duties but that it was listed in the regulation required in the blue signal protection. No other restriction task that the utility employee can perform um, with the crews that do not require the blue signal protection. No more than three utility employees can be assigned with the train or yard crew at the same time. The utility employee does not is not assigned to work with one of the train train or yard crew at a time. Inspection of the utility employee hours of service and records utility employees has to be generally vicinity to the crew. The utility employee cannot be working at a remote site and without locomotive with the rest of the crew nearby. Regulation 21823 Blue Signal Display. Blue signal displayed in accordance with statute 218.25, signify that the workers under the between the rolling equipment, which when it's sort of displayed, the equipment is not to be coupled. The equipment may not be moved except for the provided with the statute 218.29. Other rolling equipment may not be produced in the same track to be reduced to the block of the view of the block signal except for the provided with the statute 218.29, A, B, and C. And the rolling equipment may not be passed and displayed. Um, signal. Blue sig B. Blue signals may be displayed in accordance with the statute 218, 25, 227, and 229 by the, each of the craft of the group. Workers going under the between the rolling equipment may only be removed at the same craft of the group. Displayed guidance of the regulation at the blue signal may only be removed at the same craft of the group that displayed if not uh, need not to be same individual just the same craft of the group with a particular work with the group or part of the group and then indicated with the regulation definition of the group of the worker the individual would have displayed his or her own vehicle blue signal the railroad choose to adopt the policy having different craft of the groups and attached an individual disc to the common blue signal having the last worker to remove his disc allow also moving the com common blue signal that practices the mo would comply with the regulation can some can the supervisor remove a blue signal if the worker for Got to remove the blue signal has gone home. The supervisor can move the blue signal displayed, but only if the known that the workers are not under, un, uh, not on or under between the rolling equipment and clear protracted of the equipment. He, if he or she is supervising with the same crap with the group of the workers. The use of the blue signals de um, derails the industry, served with the railroad call with the uh, Department of Labor, Occupational Safety, Health, and Administration, the hazard re material regulation protection of the industry, workers involved with loading and unloading railroad cars, and not part of the part, so, of part B, the blue signal protection with workmen, however, the blue signal is displayed on the tracks rolling equipment, regardless of whether the authority the signal is displayed, the railroad employees must respect the signal as though it was displayed in accordance with the requirements of regulation. Blue signals are displayed in the industry, would not be removed, the railroad employees, also railroad employees working with under the between rolling equipment inside 
of the industry plant served by the railroad, blue signal protection must be established. A blue signal displayed at, a, at near or manually operated with the providing with the access to the track must be displayed not further than the track following of the clearance panel the entrance switch. Once the blue signal is properly displayed, there can be no movement in of the equipment except for the private in statute 228-29. Regulation 218-24, one person crew. Guidance per two statute two eighteen twenty one twenty four um two eighteen twenty four one person crew per two eighteen twenty four one person crew provisions was suspended after the effect of the May May fifteenth, nineteen ninety five. Railroads are not required to comply with any of the part of the section during the stay until the revised rule is issued by the FRA Railway Policy regarding a single person crew. Locomotive engineers working along such as a holster and hope services as follows. When working under the between the equipment they also called to operate the blue signal protection is required for the single person um crew. However the signal person RCO the remote control operator of the crew do not um, have an o on board crew uh, OC operating crew board. Uh, his possession were going on the between the equipment. If there are other reasons, she or, he or she are no longer um, control the equipment. He or she will be called to operate the definition of the train yard mem member at 218.55. Blue signal protection would be required for the for a single person crew. Regulation statute statute 21825 work of the works on the main track works that are under between the rolling equipment on the main track of blue signal must be displayed at the end of each of the rolling equipment if the rolling equipment is provided with includes one or more of the locomotives blue signal must be attached to the controlling locomotive location which is readily visible engine man operating with the control of the, of the, the locomotives when emergency repair work is to be done under the between the locomotive one or more of the cars under the locomotives blue signal are not available the engine operator must be notified effective measures must be taken the workers making the repairs guidance. The important thing to realize with observing the blue signal protection of the main track of the regulation does not require line and block the switches of the application three rails. However, the blue signal is to be displayed at each end of the rolling equipment protected by the end of the equipment referred to the placement of the blue flag, blue light, knuckle with the, of the, on the other cover layer of the car local. The inspector should check if to see if it has been done appropriately. The blue signal the blue signal definition the blue signal displayed at each end of the rolling equipment must be attached to the ends of the equipment and displayed on the track the head behind the equipment is so the manner that there is no doubt of the track equipment with which it applies. One one or more of the locomotives among the protected equipment, the blue signal also to be attached with the control locomotive with the location where it's readily visible. Someone see with the control locomotives, the inspector should evaluate visible obvious blue signal someone seated with the controls of the locomotive the requirement in addition with the blue signals displayed at each end of the equipment the signal should be placed where the operator does not have to look at for the clamping of the hang hanging of the window sill with the blue signal position with the long low on the car low on the car body of the locomotive would com not comply in other words the signal must be immediately visible to the operator without any effort of the on his part the absent blue signal any of the required locations also behind and Ahead, behind, and on the controlling locomotive beams, the equipment is unprotected with other inside the train crew. Employees may not work under the between the equipment. Remote control switches cannot be used to fulfill the requirements of Statute 218.25. The A and B provided with the protection of mainline track as Statute 218.30. Remote control switches reference only the Statute 218.27. Other main track. Um, when permissible, remote control switches to be in line and locked against the movement of the main track of the control operated with the dispatcher ordered to provide with additional protection against the situation requiring blue signal protection on the main track of the such addition. Action does not fulfill the requirements of Statute 218.25. Normally, there are very few um, few locations routinely performing the requiring the blue signal protection on the main um, track. The exemption of the railroad maintains the full servicing fact facility mainline for the trains. As the location first to determine that any work is being done with the requires the blue signal. Remember, there are certain expectations constituting the servicing and testing fueling is considered with one of these exemptions. A fuel hole stretch over the track must be, does not require the blue signal protection. An emergency protect provision would be intended to allow the railroad the flexibility of the train to stop at the main track under the emergency exit. Circumstances under the situation, condition of the can, uh, provisions can be used when the blue signal is available, provided that the train's engine and the crew had full control over the train movement. The provisions are, was, are not intended to be used for the convenience and simply because the carrier neglected to maintain a sufficient supply of blue signals for normal use for the mechanical personnel. The emergency provisions provided with the alternate means of providing with the protection worker, workers whenever the um, train is to stopped under the engine emergency circumstances, the blue signals are not available. The provision does not apply with the train in any portion. Of this concert of the yard, and it's unless the no mechanical department um, employs the working of the yard, and there's no blue signals available. 
when emergency repair park work is done under the between the locomotive and one of the more of the cars the couple of the locomotive the blue signal is not available to the locomotive the engineer operating with the controls controlling locomotive when notified of the effect of the measure must be taken to protect the working ma making of the repairs the emergency must acquire, acquire occur within the train moving to the control with the assigned train and crew the main depart mechanical department assigned with the company with the train between the terminals monitoring the performance of the equipment of the company with the dimensional and can emergency provision but those long as the train crew members the control of the locomotive Regulation 2, 18, 27 workers on the track other than the main track. When a worker is on or under between a rolling equipment on the main track, the blue signal must be displayed near, near each of manually operated switch providing access to the track. Each manually operated switch providing with access on the track of the equipment is located with the line and against the movement of the track looked and the effective locking device. See the person of the changing of the workers must be notified with the operator with the remote control switch that work is performed has been informed with the operator that each remote control switch providing access to the track on which the equipment is located it has been lined against the movement to track and locked in prescribed in statute 2 1830. If the rolling equipment require blue per signal protection put up in the section on the train, track equipment one or more of the crossover with the bolts to switch. It is each crossover must be lined against the movement of the crossover torn toward the rolling equipment to switch for each of the crossover provided the access. The rolling equipment must be protected in accordance with the provisions of A, B, and C of the section. E, the rolling um, equipment is protected and includes one or more locomotive blue signal must be attached to the control locomotive as the location which is readily visible for the engine and operator to control the locomotive guidance. This type of blue signal protection used in the train yard siding can only be can also be used in locomotive service track areas or car shop repair areas. An appropriate blue signal or blue signal definition displayed or manually operated with the provided with the access track displayed in fact not for the track of the following points of the entrance of the switch and car of the point locomotive position almost at the following point of the entrance of the blue signal displayed and attached to the end of the rolling equipment. Either the blue signal must be displayed in the same manner, no doubt about the track of the equipment in which it applies. However, the derail is used. The blue signal must must be displayed at each derail section. See Title 49 CFR 21829C. The absence of the blue signal, any manually operated switches provided the access to the track renders the track um, protected, but the work cannot be worked on, on or between the equipment on the track. The absence of the blue signal and derail rendered to the unprotected signal unlocked of derail the manual remotely controlled switch provided with the access the tracking of the equipment and standing of the movement means. Of the equipment on the track and protected, but the workers cannot work on it the, between, the, between the equipment. Rolling equipment may not enter the departed protected track exemption only after all the work of the activity is deceased. The work has not been notified. The stand clear the blue signal protection has been removed from the switch through the equipment. will move the rolling equipment and enter in the department of the protected track when, the re when using a derail lock in the derailing position with the proper blue signal displayed in the derail. The protected track of the air is between the locked derails. Therefore, all the all other rolling um, equipment may enter the department from the track but cannot enter the departed with the protected tra area of the track. The other blue signal is established there can be no movement of the rolling equipment with the protected track area and in a situation involving the workman worker worker working on the train under the blue signal protection road work road power could be added to the train removing the blue signal head on only thereby eliminating the need for the work area to the rear similar to the work same work can allow the train to depart but after the re removed the blue signal head on of the train and in both instances work must be stopped while the blue signal has been removed after the train has been departed the track, the remaining blue signal protection was immediately removed. When the crossover switch leaves the track of the protected equipment and standing with the switch at the both ends of the crossover must be lined against the entry of the protected track. The switch end of the crossover that connects directly to the protected track must be locked. Blue signal must be displayed at the lock switch. However, the protected equipment standing of the switch, such as a crossover at the block, other equipment must enter the protected track through the crossover switch, not be locked or the blue signal displayed when the work when is there engaged in the work on the train with the rear portion standing of the track other than the main track the head or end of the portion of the main track the rear portion must be protected in accordance with statute two eighteen twenty seven the workman on the train track other than the main track while the head end of the prote protected by the blue, blue signal uh, head with the locomotive at one hand at the track one head attached to the current control locomotive in accordance with statute two eighteen twenty five workman on the main track. If one or more of the locomotives are among 
of the protective equipment, the blue signal must be displayed with the control locomotive the location with read, read, readily visible to someone at the seat with the control locomotive. The inspector should evaluate how visible or obvious the blue signal is to someone seated with the control locomotive. The signal should be placed in the operator does not look for, have to look for the clamping hanging on the window with the blue position low on the car body. Or the locomotive would not comply with the other words. Signal multiple must be immediately visible. The operator within an effort of this part, the absence of the blue signal, any of the required locations m means the equipment is unprotected with workers may not work on and under the equipment. If there's a single locomotive, one end of the yard worker and yard track and the locomotive consists with it, with or without the car's locomotive, it is on the other end of the same yard tra track of the works, and replacing the work of the shoe with the locomotive, but not w being performed in other consistent controlling locomotives and the consistent signal locomotive would be both have to be blue flagged. All right, 21829, alternate methods of providing with the blue signal protection in accordance with statute 21827. The following methods of blue signal protection may be used when the workers are on you, under or between the rolling equipment locomotive services or area. The blue signal must be displayed in near the each of the switch providing the entrance or the departure of the area. Two, the each of the switch providing with the entrance of the departure of the area that must be aligned with the against the area of the locked and the effective locking device. The three, the blue signal must be attached to each controlling locomotive at the location which is readily visible. Engine man or operator controls the locomotive. If the speed within the area is restricted not more than five miles per hour, the derail capable of restriction area of the portion of the track within the area of the rolling equipment is located will fulfill the requirements manually operated with the switch compliance with the paragraph A2 of the section position with the last 50 feet from the end of the complete equipment protected with the blue signal. When the lo locked in the derailing position, effective the locking device with the blue signal on display, but the derail. Five, a locomotive may be moved, um, locomotive inspe servicing any track of the blue signal and be removed the entrance switching. And the, however, the locomotive may be stopped and coupling in another locomotive. But the locomotive may be below, moved off the locomotive service area track of uh, traffic of a uh, track of after the blue signal has been removed with the controlling locomotive to be moved after the departure switch. Seven. If the operator with the authorized employee under the direction of the person in charge of the operation of the worker's locomotive protected the blue signal be repositioned with the area after the blue signal had been removed completely with the reposition with the workers and on affected track and be notified with the movement, the blue signal protection moved with the movement of the locomotives in the paragraphs eight, five, six, and the section restored immediately for the locomotive clear of the switch when the workers are uh, are on and under between the rolling equipment and the car shop repair track area. One blue signals must be displayed near each of the providing entrance of the departure of the area. Two, the each of the providing entrance of the departure of the area must be lined against the movement of each of the locks affecting the locking devices. Three, the if the speed of um, within the restricted is not more than five miles per hour, the derail capable restriction air access to portion of the track with the area with the rolling equipment is located with the full requirements manually operated with the switch compliance with the paragraph A2. Of this section will be positioned 50 feet from the end of the equipment protected with the blue signal with locks and derailing with the effective locking device when a blue signal is laid at the railway derail. For if operating authorized employee uses it under the direction of the person charged in the workman to cover the move and the may be used to reposition the rolling equipment in the, in, within the area after the work is affected, the track have been notified and moved. C. As provided with the paragraphs A through B of the section, when the paragraphs are under the um, between the rolling equipment and on any of the track other than the main track, a derail capable restriction access over the portion of the track on which such equipment is located to fulfill the requirements manually operated switch mode and position not less than 150 feet at the end of the such equipment. And through two, the each of the derailment must be locked in the derail position. Effective locking device blue signal must be displayed at each of the rail. When emerging, when emergency repair of the work is to be done between the locomotive and one more of the coupled with locomotive blue signal not equipped with the engine man operated with the control of the locomotive may not be notified effective the measure must be taken to protect the workers being repaired. Guidance the section provides the railroad with an alternative method of establishing blue signal protection of equipment occupying the tracks of the locomotive servicing areas, the car track, uh, repair track areas. At these locations, the railroad may establish a blue signal protection in accordance with the, either the statute 21827 of the workers on the track other than the main track in accordance with this section. Inspectors must know these, uh, whether the 21827 and the 21829 are being used before taking any kind of enforcement action. 
Basically, 21827 requires the blue signal protection established for the individual track, while 21829 permits blue signal protection and to be established for the area as a whole. It provides the greater flexibility of movement of the equipment as well as um, to and from the area. The section authorized the lock derails fulfilled the requirements manual operated with the switch on any track on the main track when the place within a distance of 100 feet from the end of the protective equipment. If the speed protected with the last 5 uh, miles per hour, the distance between the reduced not less than 50 feet when you use the locomotive service of the car shop of the repair track. The Per 21829B A and B, the five mile restriction may be conveyed with the physical sign written bolt in timetable. The instruction of derail is used and it may be locked in the derail position. Effective locking devices, the blue signal must be displayed in the derail. Blue signals must be attached with the controlling locomotive, whether the workings are and or are between the locomotive with the rolling equipment attached to the locomotive. Locomotive not, locomotive not blue flag with an air black flagged, new black, new blue, not blue flag within the air can be moved. The removing the blue signal displayed in the entrance of the provider. Entrance is provided. The locomotive does not impact the couple of the locomotive with the blue signal display. The locomotive is operated with authorized employee with the direction of the person in charge within workers. The workers affected with the track of the movements will take place that have been notified with the movement. When the locomotives move into the in and out of the locomotive service area, the workers do not have to stop the locomotive. They have the blue signal properly displayed. The blue signal protection immediately restored after the movement in and out of the servicing area. When inspection adequacy, blue signal protection, locomotive service to car, repair track engines for the detailed work of the under this between the rolling equipment, determine the protection provided with the, each of the, each of the provided with the maintains the entrance of the area, the proper each of the blue dis, uh, signal display properly displayed, physical testing lock of the manual switch of the Z rails, ensure the security. Next, observe the operation inside the area. Then keep in mind when they're using the alternate method, locomotive servicing area, the, every locomotive that has a working or working working on or under becomes the required the blue signal attached with the control locomotive the readily visible operator with the controls of the locomotive. The means of the locomotive is to be in itself, not co co coupled to another locomotive. It must have a blue signal displayed as it controls it. Um, the locomotive being worked on in a couple of the three or four locomotives may have the following applies. If four locomotives were pneumatically, electrically, mechanically coupled together, all four responded to the controls only with the one locomotive lead unit, and, they all, and the only controlling lead unit requires the blue signal displayed as controls. Two or four locomotives are coupled together with a control cable with multiple use hoses and connected so that the locomotive responds to the control locomotive. Then all the four locomotives will require a blue signal displayed at the controls. If the four locomotives are coupled together with the intent to make the fourth unit consist of the control of the locomotive, the effort rate determines that the brake house of the jumper cable to be connected with the automatic brake valve is cut and the multiple units are placed in trail position of three locomotives with the controlling locomotive with the automatic brake valve cut in has a black and blue signal to, um, display at the controls. No, unless the automatic brake valve is cut out with multiple units with place in the trail of the position of the blue signal to be attached with the locomotives are capable of being used in the controlling unit before the locomotive with the control of the multiple unit is connected with the additional working cutting of the automatic brake valve in and out, setting the multiple unit valve with not considered with work equipment. Remember the provisions have been made of the regulation used alternate methods for positioning the rolling equipment within the air. However, they may only be done with and when and all the regulations are, are met. All right, regulation 21830, the remote control switches after operating the remotely controlled switches have notification required in statute 21827. How, how, how must the, um, how he must blindly, uh, he must blindly each remotely controlled against the rem movement of the track and apply the effective locking of the device of the lever, but in any other device and control switch before he may inform the employee of the charge of the work or the protection that has been provided to the operator may remove the locking device unless he has been informed of the person in charge of the workers if so to do so. The operator must maintain 15 days of the written um, record of the, each of the notification which contains the following information, the name and the craft of the employee of the charge provided with the notification, two, the number of the other designation of the track, three, the date and the time operator notified the employee in charge of the protection and provided within accordance with paragraph A of the section. Four, the date and the time the operator was informed that the worker has been completed with the name of the craft employee in charge with the provided with the information. Guidance. The operator referred in this section employee who has been delegated responsibility for the proper safe operation of the control board when effect term effective locking devices are used in the reference of remotely controlled switch of the need to not be pad locked may be plug or key but properly inserted with the control panel with the installation server the immobilization switch control lever being used in established protection the device must be applied with the set and it's a manner of the control lever cannot be thrown with the route of the protected route without through the throw first removing the lock device whatever the type of the locking device used utilizing the immobilize the switch lever button it must be a 
effectively preventing the from the beginning of the move. We're in attack alone, attached for the lever of the button. It does not prevent the lever button from the being manipulated. manipulated. We do not comply on any remote control switch that can be overridden with the field with the use of the manual lever without obtaining the prior authority. Taking the switch out of the proper power would have the treaty of the manual switch will be locked in the field. Occasionally, a track with, which had blue signal protection is not applied, but we'll have one more of the switch to provide access to the track remotely controlled. If the case is certain measure must be taken to the carrier to ensure the adequate protection when you find a location like this, this check these switches are being controlled. An inspection should be made in the written records of the railroad is required to maintain the written records and inspection of the completeness one of the date and time the operator received the notification of the work to be formed. Note that item one of the regulatory requirement if suggesting too great is as uh, good practice. True, the name of the craft of the employee charged with the provided with the notification. Three, the name number of the designation of the track involved. Four, the date of the time number of the notified employee with the charge of the protection as provided within the accordance of part A of the section at five, the date and time they informed that the work had been completed with the date and craft of the employee of the charge provided with the information. Such written records should be made in a Corns made once and never from the memor memory or mem memorandum. Check effective locking device may be being applied with the remotely controlled switches. Train additionally lever button. Similar devices have been used. The control switches mechanically locking devices, pin clamps, sleeves, button toggles. When you when we apply the device, prevent prevent accident or removal move, removal protection. Increasing computer programs are now being used in place of levers between buttons to operate the remotely controlled switches. The safeguard is excellent. The movement of the protected switches may not be obvious. The system applying the padlock plug key or impractical. The general use of the methods of computer programs require one or more of the extra entries of the computer keyboard but before releasing the switch movement. If and only one additional step is required, evaluated whether the forces that operate the realize. Uh, if he is or she is attempting to switch to the blue signal is applied. If you have a question concerning sufficient being um, provided with the operator to describe what steps he or she may um, can operate to provide and remove the any, any the switch or the for individual group workers for only that ploy at once. Regardless of the method used to operate the remote control switches, remember the intent of the locking device provision force of the operator to make special efforts to remove the protected switch. The cost of the operator to recall the worker to the rolling equipment on the track is to use the government judgment in determining if this has been accomplished. The inspection remote control switches will require a different reporting procedure. In most cases, the blue signal reporting is entered with the FRA Form 61896 together with any of the equipment related to the inspection results. The true of the, um, this is true for any blue inspection, blue signal inspection, and spe except for when remotely controlled switches are involved. The reason is, of this is not, in most cases, the control of the blue signal protection is under the direct supervision of the mechanical department. Therefore, the blue signal equipment can be combined with the same report presented by the responsible mechanical department office of the handling. However, the cause of remote Remotely controlled switches separated the part report of the FRA Form 61896, um, while the other numbers will be required. It is best to leave a copy of the report with the railroad office official, ill directly responsible for the type of the condition found. Remotely controlled switches usually and under the control of transportation defectives must be handled within directions. Equipment conditions be handled separately with mechanical official, official when, why, and there is a need for the separate report. The inspector should also have a leave to comply with a separate report with the mechanical department supervisor before. Because failure to protection of remotely controlled switches will most likely like most likely impact mechanical personnel. All right, this is by the FRA. It's a letter from Chapter Six.